hello EDS alerts are not working I think this was supposed to be trigger fire I think their site might be down because I have the bot that I use streamer bot over here so hmm, I think the website is down because I'm pretty sure father is like that um, sound alert thing Ugh, can't remember honestly I don't even spend that much time on alerts and all those stuff nowadays so I mean that's why <laughs> when you get old right you get exhausted from small small things no nah, but um, uh, I'm just having ice cream honestly pretty shit dinner but don't know the half of it <laughs> oh please I do okay you cannot you cannot say you can't say that I'm your father okay I know more than you about this. But how are you doing? Um, so BDS, I think we already talked about I went to London, right? Um, I took some photos. <laughs> and yeah, that's basically what I'm... Sh you came perfectly at the beginning, almost at the beginning. So, you'll get to go through all photos. Let me know if you find any interesting photos. I'll also mark photos which I feel are like interesting. So there's this tower. I don't know what exactly it is about. But I was just practicing taking some photos. Yeah, I mean the first one is just a general, um, you know. The underground train that I took so not uh, this is more like a test shot honestly and th these are also like test shots if you ask me oh yes interstellar theme yes yes exactly I was like you know what fuck copyright if they don't want to take down the stream let them who cares Mm. So, uh, let's see. Oh, I was still like trying to adjust some settings, and I think this is from like a custom uh, mode that I have in. Oh, yes, of the shard, exactly. This is the London shard. So, I was basically trying to adjust the settings still as you can see i'm like still trying to adjust like this one is like totally dark in comparison right because <laughs> it's like i haven't configured my camera yet properly this is just me being how do i say an amateur you need father fix there will be more don't worry Okay, this is from the shard. Look at this. Look at this view. You got this one is a bit too blurry. I'll just give this has some potential, so I'll give this like a two star. But you'll see, like, the, so what happened was the day I went to the shard. Uh, first, um, let's see. Uh, Yan was already at around the shard area but the thing was I had no internet in London uh, 
I guess the full effects of Brexit have finally taken place and my network provider no longer provides how do I say my network provider no longer uh, includes UK in the free um, Shen, uh, what is it the free roaming area so yeah it is what it is and yeah uh, so no cheap sim card I was thinking like for three days does it make sense and I knew I would be spending a lot of time with uh, Yan Foxy and uh, James so I didn't bother buying a sim card I had Wi-Fi at my hostel so what I did also was I uh, downloaded London map you can download maps in Google Maps and GPS works even when you don't have data that's one thing to remember GPS works <laughs> Yes, leeching off. <laughs> oh my god. Mm -hmm. But basically, I had offline maps and GPS to help me when I didn't have hotspot around. Uh, so it worked out, honestly. Uh, but yeah, this is from Top of the Shard. Like you can see like there's some green tint, right? And that is because like the sunlight was so harsh that day. And everything's behind a glass. So um, there's gonna be some tint, but you can probably figure out that's the famous bridge. The tower bridge. So much sunlight, exactly. So much sunlight. Oh, Tyler, uh, that uh, father redeem. I don't know why it's broken, but for some reason, Jojo is working, but father is broken. Welcome, Tyler. Rack. Um, so I'm just started sharing some photos from my London trip. I went to the Shard, which is like the tallest tower in all of Western Europe, basically. And from there, you can see, okay, this one has some potential, but I need to do a lot of color correction on this one to make it work. Like you can see, like this is better compared to this one for sure. I can work on this one um, this is another view of that with this ship I think this ship remains always I believe this ship always remains so I'll just keep this ah, you can see like there's a lot of refraction from the glass going on so it's a bit difficult to get Oh, internet is shit. No worries, no worries, man. Like here, you can see like there's a green tint, but at least the colors look nice. So I can just change. Like I can do like a, a color correction and get like really good colors. Green tint where? Look at this. Does this not look green to you? Hi, Bonk. Hello. Hello. Today, I'm having some ice cream. And showing you guys London photos. London. Mic is really low. Yeah, today, I don't know why the mic is really low. But at the very least, the quality shouldn't be bad. Right? I hope so. 
Is the quality of the mic bad? I can try... Can't you turn up the mic? Uh, let's see. Hello? Is this better? No? How about this? Is this better? Is my audio any better now? Same. Yes. Better. All right. Good, good, good. And I'm going to put a limiter. How about this now? Is this better than what it was? All right. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I, I, I had some presets. Uh, so perfect. Okay. At least the audio should be better than last stream where I have no idea what happened to the audio. Why it became like that. Not editing, we are just selecting photos. Selecting photos that we like from the UK trip, a London trip. Just London. This time it was just a weekend tour. So I only had like Friday. I, I arrived Friday night. I had entire Saturday, Sunday, and Monday was the flight back towards the evening. So on Monday, I went to some museums by myself. I should speak in some British accent. Nah, nah, man. I'm not going to fake my accent. Why? Why? <laughs> Would you like me to speak more British? <laughs> Since we're doing London, all right. Here you can see the London Bridge along with the other bridges in this perfect view from the Shard. The Shard is the tallest structure in Western Europe. Have I been in pub fights? Unfortunately not. And welcome Bruce, welcome to the stream. <laughs> I don't think I can keep up the, with this stupid accent if you ask me. <laughs> Ah, uh, boy. Oh, yes. There was this train line. And... Shot it in the... Sh <laughs> no, no, I did not. Uh, if I had something bad, probably I would have. <laughs> did I eat chicken tikka masala since it's the national dish? Unfortunately, no, I didn't have chicken tikka masala because I just wanted to have fun. And this trip was more oriented towards, you know, meeting people, having fun with them. Have I met Rishi? That's confidential. Even if I did meet Rishi Sunak, I am definitely not going to tell you guys. <laughs> It's funny. Yeah, for sure. For sure. Okay, I'm gonna stop it. it it's just stupid. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I think like, like, look at this. The, 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 like, the day I visited the Shard, it was so, how do I say? It was so sunny. It was like a glass house inside and we were really, really, really sweating. We were sweating from everywhere. That's how hot it was. So, unfortunately, not a lot of good shots as is from the shot, but I think with a little bit of editing, it should be fine. With a little bit of color correction, it should be fine. How was the teeth? Um, I don't know. They never open their mouth when talking. It's always like they're mumbling. They don't open. Uh, they don't do that. Hello, good. Hello, 
please they don't they don't show their teeth they don't so unfortunately i could not sh confirm whether the brits have bad teeth or not hey sam hello how you doing look at this this is the view from the shard but sam you live in new york so for you like these kinds of views are nothing you're so used to it you're so used to it my man again there's so much sunlight over there oh yeah the bar we had this uh, rooftop bar over there and obviously well, i didn't want to <laughs> I don't think any one of us wanted to like spend anything on it, but at least it looked nice. So I'll give him that. It looked really nice. So definitely I'll just give them credit where credit is due. I wake up to the view of New York City skyline. Bro, you don't even share any photos. Come on, you should do that now. You've been there for so long and we don't get to see anything about New York. Come on. Yeah, man, you gotta take pictures. Exactly. Alright, here we go. Our first superstar. James. Oops. Let's see. Ooh, ooh. Look at this man. Oh, yeah, look at this lad. We got this shot view over here. Yep, James. Hot. Exactly. Hot indeed. This is me. <laughs> this is me just. Uh, I am always in a gym. <laughs> Why? Why is it always. There's always something about me and jails that makes me. <laughs> I was supposed to meet up with James today, but no response from him yet. I mean, uh, what time is it right now in New York? He's a bit slow when it comes to <laughs> morning meetup times. 1.28. I mean, you can message. Um, just message once on Discord and on Instagram. And just leave it at that. He knows how to find you. But otherwise... What is this? Oh my god! Why do I look high? What is this? What is this? No! <laughs> no! No! I look high as hell. <laughs> oh my god. I, I swear, I swear. All right. Okay, why am I hiding behind? Uh, so I think this was um uh who took these pictures? I think it was Yan who took those pictures. Oh, I I took this one. I I I, I like this shot, so I'm just going to mark it. But this is basically when you go to the shot, you're not actually at the topmost level. There's still a lot more levels above you where they have all sorts of maintenance equipment. And, you know, uh, they just talked about it. You ate octopus? Well, Foxy ate octopus. I just had a little bit of taste. And... I don't think it was the first time I had octopus. No, I had squid before. This is the first time I had octopus. I heard you ate. Mm hmm. Yeah, 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 sure, sure. Was it bad? No, I liked it. I really liked it. No, Foxy is a pescatarian. So she eats seafood, basically food that anything that swims, you know, fish, seafood, because she's like from coastal Portuguese town. So it's pretty natural for her to eat seafood. 
and otherwise vegetarian. Mm. Mm. It's not chewy. The one that I had was really nice. Like, I don't know. It felt like very meat. meaty, I would say. I liked it. I can understand that, you know, octopus might be an acquired taste. Here we go, Yan. He's being so awkward right now. I think I got a better one over. Which one? Which one do you guys like more? Yes, Yano. Yano is here. Look at this handsome boy. Oh yeah. I don't know if he closed his eyes here. Oh, he almost closes. Because this one is like at least this one looks. Ah, so good, so good. The celebrity is here exactly, you know. Nice, nice. Did it? <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, no, 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 I did not. All right, let's see. And yeah, this was when uh, there was some guide who was explaining stuff in the shot and I was just taking some... how do I say? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, Yan didn't want to be in the shot. James was ready for it, but the camera focused on Yan's face. <laughs> you can see how much he hates me. <laughs> in front of the camera with <laughs> was like <laughs> oh boy ah oh, this is perfect this is like if yan needs to have a tinder profile this is it this is yan's tinder profile look at it perfect perfect come on tell me this is not perfect And I got one for me too. Oh, oh, what's happening? So the same, same, same position, basically. <laughs> oh, and one more. Oh, I was trying to flex so hard, but I look like I'm constipating. Yep, this is a constipated view. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's set up your Tinder profile. Oh, nah. Oh, this is a bit too bright. This was just fine, I would say. Ah, I mean, Yan was basically trying his best, you know, with the photos. I don't blame him. Hmm. Oh. All right, we managed to take like a selfie. We did a selfie with the camera itself. So we finally got one selfie over here. Ah, perfect, perfect. <laughs> and man, why do I look like an idiot over here? <laughs> Ah, this is even more horrible. Ah. <laughs> ah, I took a better photo over here. I'll just take this. Oh, yeah. What we were trying to do is try to take a picture of all three of us and the background. But it was very difficult to do that. Like one person and the background was easy. But all three of us was becoming like, look at that. If I try to focus more on the background, the person disappears. If I try to focus more on him, the background becomes blurred. So I guess this is the best that we can do, really. Or rather, what my camera can do at the moment. Unless, I guess there is a way to do it, and I don't know how to do it. And that's what I need to learn. But look at that. 
Handsome. Yeah, look at... Uh, I didn't do him justice. But basically... We were trying to... Oh my god. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> you gotta take two pictures. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> oh boy. Oh, okay. We got someone to take our pictures, but... I don't think he took it the way we wanted. We have to brighten up these ones. Like, we have to brighten up the shadows. But at least we can see the background over here. Okay, I, I feel like this is salvageable. So I'm going to just mark this. And I'm going to try to edit this one. Where am I now? I'm back home. Back in Stockholm. Stockholm is my home now. That's where I am, micro. How are you doing? I was in London for, I guess, a late birthday celebration with some friends. I mean, it's not really about the birthday celebration. It was just about going to London again. It was so nice, you know. Photoshop them together. One with the person in the focus and the other without and Photoshop them together. You're assuming I have the skills to do that, Bruce. <laughs> Man. Yep, yep, England, exactly, exactly. Bruh, study in UK ads are killing me. <laughs> maybe, maybe it's a sign for you to go to the UK to study. Who knows? But what did you study, uh, Rack? Like... My trip was sponsored. I wish, but no. This is just sponsored by my... <sighs> just by myself, because I'm just hardworking enough to pay my own bills, to save up enough for traveling. How tall am I? I'm 184 centimeters. 184. And Yan is almost as tall as me. I guess he's also like 183, 184. James is a bit shorter, but I don't know how much shorter, but... Tell me what you think of English Indians and how they're different from you. Hmm... That's true. I, I mean, the, culturally, they are basically... You know, they're... I, I would say... Software-wise, they're English. It's just hardware that looks Indian. But everything else, honestly, very British. Like, they don't have that Indian environmental upbringing. So, it's gonna be different. Like, the some cultural norms will be different. Some experiences will be different. Like, even if I, let's say settle down in Sweden even if I naturalize as a Swede I'm not gonna be like 100% Swedish but maybe if I had like a kid then they would have a more Swedish experience because then they grow up in Sweden you know and then I would say that the kid probably doesn't have an Indian experience so they're not Indian really maybe Indian hardware <laughs> But software, totally Swedish. Alright, let's move on to... Oh yeah, these ones. Oh, I love these ones. I took some... Oh, okay, uh, which one do I like more? Which one do you guys like more? This one or this one? I like this one. <laughs> more kids? Oh no, no, no. Love that software and hardware. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess as an engineer, you tend to use technical terms to ex describe your experience, describe yourself more effectively. But yeah, that's just how I see myself, really. Alright, so 
Look at this, King Yan. Let's go. Look at this. Oh, ooh. Look at that. Last stream was about marriage. Now we're talking about kids. No, 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 no. Everyone today would get that. I think most people here today are from some technical background. So I think what how I'm speaking basically resonates with most of the people over here. So mic went low. Am I am I good? He's moving fast. Oh. Is it okay now? Cannabis? Nah, bro. No. <sighs> Low. I don't know, man. Because the microphone's battery is also very low at the moment. So it might just be that the battery is giving out. Who knows? Let's see. Uh, uh, don't. Don't. How about now? Any better? Blah 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 blah. La 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 la. <laughs> Same? Hmm. But can you hear me? Or should I just mute the background music so that you guys can hear me better now? Now this is the only audio source, so... Should be fine. Hopefully. I can, no worries. Alright, great. Because I feel like I might have to change the mic battery after this stream. So, yeah, it's a good bet to mute it. All right, nice. And, ooh, this one was mine. <laughs> I love this one. I love this one. Oh, boy. And then we went to a uh, borough market, I believe. Um, whiskey ginger. There was it. There were like so many people that day. It was insane going to the market. It felt like I'm in India, you know, so with so many people. Like you don't see that density of people anywhere in Sweden. Nowhere in Sweden you'll find. That many people, so just enjoy some photos. There are no people in there are people in Sweden, okay? If I did IRL streams right now, VDS, whenever I go out, there will be people, okay? Simply because this is Stockholm. There are people over here. You don't believe me? Come. Come to Stockholm. Come to Stockholm. Come here. Come here. And then you'll realize what I'm talking about. Have you been to any Thai restaurant in Stockholm? Um, no, actually. Have I been? The last restaurant I went to was Greek. I mean, it was nice, but it was kind of overpriced also. So I don't know if I could recommend it. But then again, maybe I'm still not used to Stockholm prices that much. But do you have any Thai restaurant recommendations? Fast food shit in Skansu? No, 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 no. Not fast food. Not fast food. Uh, it's a proper seat in greek restaurant that i went to um, i don't remember exactly it's a bit difficult i have to see basically in my messages i know agapi grill and bar it's in ringwayen so the food was nice, it's just that the prices felt a little bit high. So I don't know if I want to like 
go again or I could just go to Greece and enjoy good authentic Greek food for much 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 cheaper for sure but here in uh, this borough market there was like all sorts of food available like there's so much street food available over here it's just insane Ooh, i feel like this could be like a nice i'll just give this some oh this guy posed i love it this guy posed hey he knows so this was some turkish uh shop i'll come i'm just waiting for the sec to plunge further down <laughs> <laughs> please oh my god i'm crying i'm crying over the fact that the corona has become so weak the swedish corona has become so weak i mean it's become weak even against the indian rupee that's how bad it is performing it's performing worse than the indian rupee so i know that something is really wrong Turkish coffee. Mm -hmm. Ooh, I like this shot also. So it was really nice and sunny. And a lot of people just sat out over there to have their food. I'm telling you, Borough Market was packed. Packed with people. Too many people, honestly. Too many people. So... I don't know what I, I think I had some Japanese food just because like I'm a sucker for it but I think we split up uh, just to have whatever we wanted and then uh, we regrouped together Thai restaurant Ko Pan Yang oh I know Medbori Atlaston let's see Gonna try to bookmark it. Ko K O H P A N J E N G Ko Pang Yang. There's a lot of it says corner garden. Huh. All right. I think I'll have this one, and then the tiger in Hornstool. Uh, let me just bookmark. Done. And then tiger. Tiger. Horn. Highlands cut. Okay. Yes. Nice. Mm hmm. right nice thank you thank you for the suggestions i bookmarked it on google maps so next time when i wanna go i'll look for i mean i always have like uh, restaurants and suggestions bookmarked in google maps so it's very easy to see from there oh yes um this one. Ooh, so this was Yan's suggestion that we go and have some oysters. So me and James never had oysters before. And this was refreshing for sure. Like I always had it with lemon, but um I think uh Yan didn't have any lemon because he just wanted the fresh sea taste of the sea. You know so i i liked i i would recommend oysters for sure if you want to have good seafood oysters is the way to go Ooh, i like this also any drinks popping open a little beer 
Uh, not really. Just ice cream for now. I mean, I I do have a bottle of vodka, but I already drank too much. I mean, I, I'm I'm not gonna drink now, honestly, uh, because I know that next week I'm gonna drink. So this t for today, no drinks. And I think this is where um, we kind of like took a rest stop where we just finished our lunch. And yeah, then I, I think we roamed around more in the borough market. Um, ah, this is this is this shot view is nice. So I think I'll bookmark this one a bit unacceptable Ugh. I'm sorry I can't drink every week I'm sorry I, I gotta control myself and also I'm trying to build muscle so I'm trying to get a bit healthy also so yeah I know that I'll be drinking next week so I'm trying to not punish my liver now. <laughs> Green market. I think it's very close to the borough market. So I, I I don't think I visited the green market. I didn't go inside the green market. So I don't I can't really say much about how what it is. Ah, oh, it's so good. Like this kind of gives me a bit of uh like markets like these kind of give me a bit of the Asian feeling, you know, like in Asia, you have all sorts of these um, open markets, very busy, packed with people. It kind of like gave me that kind of feeling. So like, I don't get this feeling anywhere in Sweden. But then again, like there's not many people in Sweden. So I, I guess it's gonna take a while for something like this to you know actually be a thing so ah burrow cheese company i think this is like one of the oldest um uh, shops in burrow market <laughs> again i was testing some shots and i was just using james as my go-to model i think at this time uh yan had like split out to do some errands and then we would meet back later uh okay frank Mianka. Nah, it's fine nothing really interesting the marketplace yeah there's like so much park street Another shot view. Ah, oh, look at this pretty, like, look at this cute small blue building. I, I think I, this is probably some pub. The Shipwright Arms. I think this is a pub. So, I, I just... <clears throat> he's photogenic. Oh, yes, for sure. Oh, this... This is one of my favorite photos that I took for sure. This is one of my favorite photos. Like you can see the tower bridge. One minute, let me. Like you can see it from here. I I I love this is going to in on Insta for sure for sure this this one is going on Insta. Some more photos. <laughs> we were just taking photos of each other and iconic sites left and right. So <laughs> you're gonna see a lot of those. Oh yeah, it was so sunny. I couldn't even keep my eyes open. Uh, <laughs> why am I holding on to my camera bag like that? I think I probably closed my eyes because it's too... Oh wow, I managed to keep it open. I can't believe it. Ah, oh, 
mind in this researcher. Look at that. Look at this. Tell me this isn't good. Another one, the tower bridge, now from like straight ahead. I like this one also. Again, I, I was like testing it, so it focused on him, on him completely. And there's a bit of background blur, but you can see that it's a tower bridge. And if I try to keep everyone in focus, then he becomes too dimly lit. So, yeah. I think this is probably the best among the three first shots that I took. This is a bit too overblown, but at least it has all the buildings here. Ooh, look at this one. Ooh, this is like, this is like postcard. This is like a postcard picture. Come on. Tell me this is not like a postcard picture. And again, more, more models. Oh, this one, like, I, I got, like, a, like, a nice uh, both view. I don't know which one is better, though. I feel like this is a bit better compared to this one. Look at this. And this guy was everywhere. I think this guy is, like, the mascot of the London. But I'm not sure about it. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to take this photo. I don't know why James felt the urge to hold his hand. <laughs> Come on, guys. Let me see. <laughs> why? <laughs> I have no clue, but... Oh, well. This is the London Wall. I think it's one of the oldest structures. This is um jeez I forgot the place where they have the jewels, you know, the royal jewels. The tower, I think this is the tower. London Tower. Uh yeah. So many photos. And then we went to some church and oh my god, this church saved us not in that sense of like jesus christ saved us kind of thing but like it was so cool like we could finally breathe it was like cool enough we escaped the hot scorching sun outside so it was definitely uh nice to get in over there by the way, I think the audio is getting more and more dim, right? Unfortunately, it looks like it's getting more and more dim. Uh, yeah. How about I just blast through the gain? If this is the maximum gain I can... This is the maximum I can do right now. How about now? Because I feel like the battery is basically dying now. Is this like too distortion-y or is this because I, I know that at least this one is hitting the orange level a bit more lower and lower it's a bit weird right but yeah I, I didn't think about like the microphone battery dying out in the middle of the stream but it is what it is Worst comes to worst, I'll switch to some other audio source, and it's gonna be horrible, but at least you can hear me reliably, but sounds weird. Yeah, because the gain, I like, I, it's like maximum gain, so it's gonna sound really bad now. Mm-hmm. Or should I just try to switch audio sources? Let's do that. Let's see. Upgrade. And 
been through five, one, two, <clears throat> no, that can't be. Okay, how do I do this? Uh, properties. Uh, Who's this one? Hello? This one's gonna sound really bad though. I feel like this one's gonna sound really bad. But this one is more uh, reliable at the moment. Or I could just sound got better. A sound, I mean, it's gonna be louder, but it's not gonna be better in terms of quality. But is this fine? Because if it is fine, then I guess we can move on. All right. All right. I'll just use this one. Better. All right. All right. Yeah, I feel like the battery is basically dying in the microphone. And I need to swap batteries. But I don't want to do that now. So. And then we went to some underground cellar in the church. Hello, paint shooter. How are you doing? Super good mic, I hear. Uh, yeah, it's fine. I guess it is what it is. Mm, mm, mm. Ah. Yeah, this is some World War II memorial, I think. Again, ah, so many shots here. And I noticed, like, this is new. These rickshaws, these are new. This wasn't there the last time I visited UK. I feel like there's some new sort of tourist camp going on with these things. No tuk-tuk. <laughs> well, this is London. Give it a few more years, there will be tuk-tuks. There was this pianist. Ah, I like this shot. Why, why am I, why am I like, who took my photo like this? Ah, oh, Foxy, yes, Foxy. There are tuk-tuks in Norway, no fucking way. I, I visited Oslo, I didn't see any tuk-tuk, come on. I haven't seen any tuk-tuk in Oslo. Uh, the <laughs> It's a bit overexposed, but you get the idea. Uh, just me being goofy, but here we go. Tuk Tuk would be good for business. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of like taxi, but uh, it's not like. A real tuk-tuk experience would be like open-air tuk-tuks and considering the typical weather in Sweden is like it's always raining a little bit, it's not going to be ideal to have a tuk-tuk unless, unless you modify the tuk-tuk to make it like uh, fully covered so that it would be usable even during rain and during winter. Although during winter, you definitely have to like pad up a lot. Rain is no problem, but the winter, the winter is going to kill you for sure. There are tuk-tuks in Paris, which are tourist traps. Yeah, the same thing in London. I feel like they are tourist traps. They are not like... Uh, like the actual tuk-tuk experience, but then again, it's like, unless tuk-tuks are like a common thing, it's always gonna be more like a tourist trap rather than an actual mode of transportation. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what, what is this? Oh my God. I just did the most typical foxy pose 
that I could think of, and this was it. Where are the nudes? No nudes. No, that's only in OnlyFans. You gotta go subscribe OnlyFans, and you need to do like a tier three subscription so that you get like a code that you can unlock the encrypted photos that you get from OnlyFans. Only then will you get the nudes. That's it. <laughs> All right, you get the idea. Oh, I think she was trying to burst shutter mode. <laughs> oh, I like this one. I don't know about you guys, but I like this one. Yes, I think this was much, much, much after. Uh, ah, because during uh, the dinner, I didn't want to take out my camera and start taking photos. So most of the photos that we have are on each other's mobile phones. So I think I shared the photo on Discord, the group photo of all four of us together. But this was like, I think afterwards, like uh, James and uh, Jan had to go a bit early. So me and Foxy just uh, uh, stayed there for some more drinks and talked a lot and then basically uh, moved on. This is day two. Oh my god, I'm going so slowly. I should probably speed up. But it says ad break. I don't know if you guys are seeing ads right now. So I guess since none of you are subscribed, I should probably wait for the ad. Oh. Oh. Ads. Are you done with the ads? Because it told me that uh, the ad break is over. All right. This is like another postcard picture. Like, come on. Tell me this is not a postcard picture. This is as postcard of a picture as it gets. Ooh. Oh, no. I feel like my app is hanging now. Ooh, okay, okay. I, I like this. I like this. So the, the framing, I'm not sure if I can frame this well because of the boat, you know. Ooh, I like this. I like this one. I like this one also. I'll go for this one just because it has better background. So the next, oh, this was some dreamy filter. To which this one is way too dreamy of a filter. So, ah, uh, I I couldn't capture the photo correctly. It's still too bright. This is what happens. Like every time I start using the camera on a new day. Most of the shots in the beginning, absolute shit, absolute shit. And then towards the end, the shots get much, much, much better. Ah, the sun, the sun was way too much in our eyes. Both of us are struggling to keep our eyes open. <laughs> but I got a good one over here. I think this is a really good photo for sure. Oh, this one was like, how many steps did we have to go up? Like, almost 200 steps or something like that. It was like a lot of flight of stairs. And it was like, you know, those old towers where they only have like one central pillar and the stairs are around that central pillar. So it's like very narrow. So it was also very suffocating. And there were like a lot of stairs, so it 
took a little while, but the good thing is for this view, only four pounds did that last week in Prague. <laughs> but this one was like four pounds ticket to go to the tower to see 287 steps Prague Castle South Tower. Oof. Would have been like a good workout, right? You don't need to work out anymore after that. Small stairway, the kind that's narrow. Yes, exactly. Exactly. Like, oh, I don't know. I mean, I know why they used to do those kind of stairways, but like, the problem is since they want to maintain the staircase as it was, the restoration uh, will not modify the staircase. And so people who want to enjoy it have to be able to navigate those kind of swirly, narrow staircases. It's always going to be annoying, for sure. Some more buildings. I don't know why this photo came about. Some more photos. Ah, look at this one. This is so good. Come on. Tell me this isn't a good photo. This was the view. We could hear all the tourists out of breath when getting towards the top. Yeah, 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 yeah. It... I mean, for me, it was fine. It was like first day. I mean, the first first thing I'm doing in the morning is just going up to the tower for these views. So I wasn't really tired that much, but Foxy got out of breath so fast, so fast. All right, and this is J. I'm, I'm, I'm. Ah, this is better. This is better, honestly. Uh, this is better for sure. Hot. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? What is this photo? <laughs> What is this? Oh my god. Big D energy. Mm -hmm. Just compensating. Mm -hmm. This is me being absolutely serious. Look at that. Unimpressed. Unimpressed like my parents are with me. Why am I looking up? I think there was something because I can see some smoke trails over here. Should have gotten your masters. I can earn enough without masters. I don't want to rush into getting a masters. So I think in hindsight, I did well without getting masters. Hmm. Okay. Okay, this is... Why am I not smiling? Why am I always... Why, why do I always have like a resting bitch face? Why? This is better. Look, much better. Much better. All right. Again, the sun. Oop. Blurred. Blurred. Focused. Nice. <laughs> okay, I, I love this photo. I love this photo. I remember when she took it. I was like, all right, let's replicate some crazy energy. And here we go. Can't even earn parent satisfaction. That's the life of an Asian, you know. You can never gain their approval. <laughs> oh, perfect. Perfect. All right, natural model over here, naturally. 
photogenic, so she doesn't need too many glasses. Yeah, um, the this was Foxy sunglasses, so I just borrowed it for some photos. Actually, she gave it to me. You know, like she saw me, like ah, oh, I'm just trying to fight the sun. And like it looked good, and I saw that the glasses were so goofy. I was like, you know, let's just do one goofy photo. Oh, this guy, this crew, one minute, come here. This fella wanted to lay flat. Look at this guy. Chilling. This guy is chilling. Oh. Look at him. Look at him. Needed to cool down? Probably, yeah. That's why he was doing that. When the glasses were on you, they looked like those 3D theater glasses. Oh, yeah, 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 for sure. BB gun time? What? No, 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 no. Oh. Oh, I like this photo. Although she's on mobile, so probably would be better. But there was some text. I don't know if I managed to get that. Okay. Is it better here? Ah, this is better. It looks like you added her on Photoshop. No, no, no. She was just there. <laughs> but we went to some... Uh, what is it? Uh, what kind of restaurant was it? Was it Turkish? No. Maybe, maybe it was Turkish. Hugo! How long is my schlong? Mm, as big as this one. So, bigger than the face. That's all. That's all you need to know, Hugo. Uh, so, huge, right? I know, huge. It's a bit too much if you ask me. But how are you doing? Uh, this is day two of my, um, like, Sunday. This was on Sunday. So we went to some restaurant. Oh, this was, okay, I remember. This one was after... We did escape room. Unfortunately, uh, we couldn't uh, complete it in time. So escape room, it was me, James, and Foxy. We did the escape room. We almost, almost solved it. But uh, I think if we had like five more minutes, we could have done it for sure. So after that, we kind of got really hungry. None of us had like a good breakfast. So we had like some nice lunch. I don't think again, like, ah, again, posing as ever. James. All right. All right. Yeah. We got James sipping on juice. Was it juice or drinks? I can't remember now. I like this. I like this photo. Yes. Ooh, what's this? More moody shot photo. It's a moody shot for sure. Adult juice. Yes, this is adult juice for sure. I give you. <laughs> I mean, Hugo, he's ready for the adult juice. You just need to go to Paris or he has to come to you, you know? James has a nice full grown. Yeah, like. His beard is like, like minus like, like one minute. I'll just look at this. What, what is this? This is nothing. This is horrible. Okay. I, I can't grow beard for shit. Even if my life depended on it, I cannot grow a beard. Unfortunately. This better than mine. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know, man. Give me 30 seconds. All right. All right. Don't worry. Can make some juice. I think 
uh, VDS wanted to have some drink, right? And Hugo's also here. Maybe he wants to join in. But again, this was some photo, although now in retrospect. 